So it's like this. I know uh, I, I have I have mentioned this before, and I know a lot of you have heard me talk about the uh, the Amber Heard uh, Johnny Depp Amber Heard defamation trial, and uh, the trial is over. And who doesn't know that Johnny won his suit? Uh, Amber was awarded one of her counter suit, but you know that that was a technicality. Um, and you would think that would be it. It would be over. Things would go back to normal. Johnny has moved on with his life because he's finally gotten to tell his truth. And uh, some people just don't want to let shit go. And that comes up for that comes up for me to say, you know what really grinds my gears? You know what really grinds my gears? Somebody who doesn't just don't want to let shit go. You you lost. Get over it. And since then, her lawyer, one of her lawyers has been on to talk about the trial. And now she's sitting down with Savannah Guthrie, an NBC News exclusive. Amber Heard is sitting down with Savannah Guthrie talking about what happened on the Today Show. So they released, they're releasing this in, th in, in, in parts on the Today Show. First part was yesterday. Second part was today. Third part is tomorrow. And I think the entire interview is going to be shown on Dateline on Friday or something. And I, I just, I just want to leave. I just, 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 just leave it alone, bitch. I'm sorry. I don't know why this triggers me so much. I don't know why the whole thing did because I actually watched the trial. I was one of those rare people because everybody's spouting off on, they just spouted off on what they saw on social media. Do dollars to donuts, uh, two thirds of those people never watched the trial. I did, I watched every day of the trial. So I've seen all the evidence. I've seen uh, I've seen and heard all the, all the testimony, the cross examinations, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. Hey, Segment, I've seen all of that. So my, my uh uh my my uh impressions of this were not formed by social media they were formed by the evidence i saw in court the and, and her burden of proof was, her her burden was not proven and she blatantly lied on the stand several times and i'm like okay and now she's sitting down with savannah guthrie to talk about this shit and uh yesterday on twitter uh the today show released the today show released a um uh, a piece of this interview and uh and and they released a second piece of it today hold on just a second i i've got to uh i've got to uh i, I want to uh i want to share this this is part of the rant today this is part one of the rant there is something else but i want to uh Share this with you guys. Check this. Check this shit out. Share what one thinks about me, um, or what judgments you want to make about what happened in the privacy of my own home and my marriage behind closed doors. I, I don't presume the average person should know those things, and so I don't take it personally. But even somebody who is sure I'm deserving of all this hate and vitriol, even if you think that I'm lying. You still couldn't look me in the eye and tell me that you think on social media there's been a fair representation. You cannot tell me that you think that this has been fair. Of course. Amber. Honey. Amber. Honey. Right here. Right here. Right here. Right here. You are a lying, scheming, narcissistic, Machiavellian bitch who tried to game the system and you lost. You brought all of this on yourself by spinning the tales that you spun. So anything that happens to you as a result of that, you brought that on yourself. So yeah, I think you're deserving. Right here, baby, right here, okay? I don't blame them, it wasn't, I, I don't blame them. I actually understand. He's a beloved character. He's a man. And people feel they know him. He's a fantastic actor. Their job is to not be dazzled by that. 
Their job is to look at the facts and the evidence. And they did not believe your testimony or your evidence. I, I, again, how, how could they, after listening to three and a half weeks of testimony about how I was a non credible person? Because you lied, bitch! Because you're presenting pictures of beatings that the pictures do not back up. I'm sorry. You claiming all this, this abuse and this damage and the pictures don't back that up. Leave a word that came out of my mouth. But here's the thing. Nobody the believes the words that are coming out of your mouth. Protects free speech. It doesn't protect lies that amount to defamation. And that was the issue in the case. Yes, exactly. You can't go into the free speech does not protect you if you you know, go into a crowded theater. If you lie, you fire. That's you right, and that's what you did. Free speech from the Greeks. My understanding of what that means is not just the freedom to speak. It's a freedom to speak truth to power. But truth is the word. Yes, and that was the issue. And that's Get all I spoke. Down. And I spoke it to power, and I paid the price. Bitch, please. Okay, okay, okay. Stop. Okay, hold on. Stop. 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 But anyway, because you, you see Savannah will go let her get away with that shit. You see Savannah will go let her get away with that shit. And, and now they're screaming that, because I'm reading the Twitter feed. I'm reading the Twitter feed. So they're screaming that, you know, Savannah has, has a, 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 a definite bias. It's like, no, Savannah is a reporter who is supposed to be there in a fair and balanced capacity to get to the truth. Um, now my thing is, oh, I think so too. I, I think so too. Cause I, I, uh, I hangs with NBC news and I, I, I know Miss Savannah Guthrie. I, I, I've seen her work out. So yeah, I think so. I think so. It wouldn't take much, <laughs> even though, uh, Amber is a hearty chick and I, I don't doubt she can, she can throw a punch. I mean, Johnny's black eyes suggest that yeah so yeah we we're not talking about john johnny yeah the pictures that they brought up in court of of uh, johnny with a black eye gee i wonder where he got that from or a burn on his cheek where a cigarette was put out on it gee i wonder where that came from so um i'm like in this this little this little pity party is continuing the third part of the interview is tomorrow and i'm like and it's NBC exclusive, so I'm willing to bet you. I'm willing to bet you anything they paid her for that interview. They had to have. I because I, you know, I, I don't think anybody is chomping at the bit to uh to get Amber Heard in front of a camera unless they're thinking about making some money. It's like what the fuck? move on, sweetheart. Move on. Move on, move on, move on. Where am I? Where's my thing? Move on. The reason, the only reason you're, she's doing this is probably getting paid because it's the only money that she's ever going to make by selling her sorry ass story. Um, but she's got to try to make some money, right? Because she got to pay Johnny back, right? No. <laughs> but the thing is, Johnny's not even worried about the money because it's not about the money. It's not about the money for Johnny. It was about being able to tell his side of the story, which he wasn't able to do in the UK trial, and now he has done that. What I hate, the main thing I hate about this situation is that it's hard enough for, for real victims to come forward in a lot of cases. It's very difficult for them to get up the courage to come forward. Men, women, children, it doesn't matter who you are because violence, domestic violence has no gender, okay? It's hard enough for victims to come forward and, and feel that they won't be believed without this shit happening because this bitch blatantly lied. There are people that see that are going to see this. I've, I've seen, I've read some accounts of people that have seen this and are, and are afraid to speak up because they think that they, they're not going to be, be, be believed that they're going to be an Amber Heard. And that was the one account I read that was their words. Exactly. So as far as trying to be a champion, for domestic abuse, she is actually hurt. She has actually hurt that effort. She has actually uh, hindered that effort greatly, and that pisses me off 
more than anything else, this bitch needs to go somewhere, sit the fuck down, and shut the fuck up. Flat out. <laughs>